Hi there. My name is Rick Curtis, and I'm an engineer here at Delta Stream. Today, I'm here to show you how our newly added MCP support can power your Gen AI agents by giving them real-time context. First off, we'll, we'll start with what is MCP? So M MCP is an open standard that defines how AI agents can discover, describe, and interact with external data and tools. Instead of hard coding API calls or writing custom integrations, MCP provides a standard interface so your agents can automatically connect to and query systems such as Delta Stream. This bridges the gap between real-time data and AI intelligence, giving your Gen AI agents up-to-date context rather than relying only on training data. Now that we uh, understand MCP, let's talk about Delta Stream as your real-time context engine. Delta Stream connects to streaming sources such as Kafka and Kinesis and can continuously materialize that data so that your agent will always have a fresh context. You can define streams, tables, and materialized views using SQL, and Delta Stream automatically keeps those views up to date as events flow in. Think of it like this. Instead of static dashboards, your Gen AI agents can query live context. Which lights are delayed right now, and MCP keeps the answers current. With MCP, these real-time views become directly available to your agents. So Delta Stream now natively supports MCP, meaning all of your materialized views can be exposed directly to Gen AI agents through a standard MCP endpoint. Access is controlled by Delta Stream RBAC, so agents only see the real-time context that they are authorized to access. No extra configuration is required. If you already have a materialized view in Delta Stream, it's automatically available over MCP. That makes Delta Stream your real-time context engine, seamlessly powering Gen AI agents with live data. So let's jump over to a small demo that I have set up. And we'll just take a look at the Streams 360 view. So I have a, a few Kafka topics set up with data streaming in. I have some flight events, booking events, and customer profiles. Um, so we're simulating a, a flight booking system and Delta Stream is providing real-time context for a Gen AI agent that we'll show you here. So when booking events arrive, Delta Stream joins that da data with customer profiles to create an enriched stream. Then when a flight event arrives, such as a delay or cancellation, we join that event with our enriched pa passenger stream so that we now have a materialized view of current passengers that are affected, and that is all real-time um, information. So the, the next step is we need to create an API token within Delta Stream. Um, we're going to skip over that because it's not terribly interesting. Once you create that API token, um, we're going to go over to using the OpenAI Agent Builder, and that's where we will configure our MCP server. So we're going to jump into the Agent Builder here. Um, I actually already have most of this set up for the sake of time. So I have a flight attendant and the instructions essentially say, hey, you're an airline concierge, um, help passengers out if they are delayed or booked. Um, go ahead and, and make suggestions for them based off from their delayed or canceled flight. Interesting thing to point out here is in tools, this flight's real-time context tool, um, that is Delta Stream, the API token that got created gets plugged in here as your auth token. Um, and here you can see for the tools, there's only one materialized view that we have access that's been exposed. Um, if you do have other materialized views within Delta Stream, you can choose those here. Um, only tools that are, only views that are visible to your Delta Stream role um, will be shown here. Uh, the other tool to point out is this flight booking tool. This is just a, a demo MCP server that I have here so we can do some interesting stuff. So let's go ahead and run this for fun. And we're going to say, hi, I'm Peter Brown. Can you help me out? And what's happening here in the background is the agent sees, hey, we have Peter Brown. And he's going to send a request off to the MPC, MCP server and sees that there's a delayed flight. Uh, then what he's going to do is uh, query the flight booking tool to find flights that would, would satisfy this user request and provide the user with a couple options. And it's as simple as that. So that's how Delta Stream can act as your real-time context engine for Gen AI agents. With just a few steps, you can connect live streams of data to your agents. Thanks for watching.